you are like my family. You probably enjoy going out to eat, but knowing which restaurants have a clean slate can be tough to tell. That's where we come in. In this week's uh, restaurant report card, Valley News Team's Christina Craig heads to Detroit Lakes to find out which eateries have a dirty plate. Our first stop is at Northside Bar and Cafe along Washington Avenue. Now, in their most recent health inspection, they were slapped with nine violations, three critical. Well, it's incredibly important, you know, if mistakes are made with improper dating and, uh, you know, spoilage, cross-contamination, I mean, you know, it ultimately can result in in uh, patrons getting sick. Soup in the cooler was not date marked. The sanitizer concentration level was way too high and some cleaning solutions lacked labels. There were small issues and they were taken care of most, uh, I would say, all but one was probably taken care of that day. 76, please. In the most recent health report, Burger King along Highway 10 was cited the most violations, totaling in at 10. Two were critical. A thin layer of slime was found in the ice machine. And a lid dispenser on our beverage bar had some spills on it. Went cleaned up right away. Mike Canope, the Burger King district manager, says every three months corporate hires an outside company to inspect the restaurants, making sure they're meeting cleanliness and safety standards. And our last stop is at Shorewood Pub along Long Bridge Road. In their most recent health report, they were marked for eight violations, one critical. The concentration level of the chlorine mixture was way too strong. I think it just got overpoured. By, I don't know who one of us working here did, but it's been fixed and I got the concentration down to where it's supposed to be. An easy fix to keep you safe. In Detroit Lakes, Christina Craig, Valley News Live. And there is some good to report. This week's Clean Plate Award goes to Kentucky Fried Chicken, located along Highway 10 in DL. During the last inspection, they had a spotless.